Question. Discuss the role of English novels in perpetuating imperial rule. English novels have played a significant role in perpetuating imperial rule throughout history. During the era of British imperialism, which spanned from the 16th to the mid-20th century, literature, including novels, served as a powerful tool for promoting and justifying imperial ambitions and dominance over colonies. Several aspects of English novels contributed to this perpetuation of imperial rule. 1. Portrayal of Colonial Subjects English novels of the imperial era often depicted people from colonized regions as exotic and other. These portrayals reinforced racial stereotypes, such as the noble savage or the barbaric native. By presenting colonized populations as fundamentally different and inferior to the British, these novels justified the need for British intervention and control over these regions. The colonial subjects were often denied agency and portrayed as passive recipients of British civilizing efforts. 2. Romanticization of imperialism Many popular English novels presented imperial conquests and adventures as exciting and glamorous endeavors. Characters like Rudyard Kipling's Kim or H. Ryder Haggard's Alan Quatermain were celebrated figures who navigated the exotic landscapes of colonial territories, discovering ancient treasures and confronting dangerous adversaries. This romanticized portrayal created an allure around imperialism and contributed to the belief that imperial rule was a noble and heroic mission. 3. Propagation of British Superiority English novels frequently promoted the idea of British cultural, moral, and technological superiority over colonized peoples. Such notions were often rooted in the prevailing racial and social theories of the time, which claimed that European civilizations were more advanced and capable of governing lesser societies. This portrayal of British supremacy further justified imperial rule as a means to uplift and enlighten supposedly backward societies. 4. Demonization of Resistance Novels often depicted native uprisings and resistance against colonial rule as acts of irrationality, cruelty, or fanaticism. Characters rebelling against British authority were often portrayed as savage and bloodthirsty which not only justified harsh repression but also created a sense of fear and insecurity among the British population, reinforcing the need for continued imperial control. 5. Fostering a sense of national identity English novels that celebrated the British Empire and its achievements helped foster a sense of national pride and identity among the English population. These novels depicted the empire as a source of national strength and greatness, instilling a belief in the moral and cultural superiority of the British people. This sense of identity, intertwined with imperial success, made it easier for the public to accept and support the maintenance of colonial rule. 6. Control of narrative English novelists, like any storytellers, had the power to shape public perceptions and beliefs through their works. Writers often incorporated colonial propaganda and ideologies into their narratives, presenting imperial rule as a necessary and benevolent force for progress and civilization. The control of the narrative by the dominant imperial powers ensured that their version of history and colonial experience prevailed, influencing public opinion in favor of continued imperial rule. While some writers did challenge the imperial narrative and critic the oppressive aspects of colonialism, these dissenting voices were often overshadowed by the prevailing ideologies of the time. It was not until later in the 20th century, as post-colonial movements gained momentum, that a more critical examination of the legacies of imperialism emerged in literature. In modern times, many authors have revisited the history of imperialism, offering a more nuanced and diverse representation of colonial subjects and challenging traditional imperial narratives. Post-colonial literature seeks to question and deconstruct the power structures that perpetuated imperial rule, opening up new perspectives on the complex and often painful legacies of colonialism.
Through these efforts, literature continues to play a crucial role in shaping our understanding of history and promoting a more inclusive and empathetic view of the world.